Hello, um, out filming next three videos, maybe just, no, yeah, maybe, we will see. I want to film three videos. Yeah, I have all my stuff in here. A lot of stuff. This doesn't belong to it, <laughs> but two tripods. My new bag, it's awesome. Um, this is a lot of stuff in here. My drone, there's the new monitor in there. That's just my bag and two tripods back there. Yeah, I just did, I just did the, the test with the GoPro and the, the ND filter. And first I put it here. So this is my, my stand. Um, this is just a, a pole that you use for construction to hold something that you just built but it's perfect for here and then I put this grip on with this head and GoPro or whatever comes in here and then I have a nice view from here and I did it here then I did it with this here with this suction cup and now right now I'm filming from outside, so if this huge suction cup, this would hold everything. So a big, this camera that I'm filming in right now, but I'm way too scared to do that. I put this GoPro on and film it a bit, and now we'll put it on the other side. Easier than I thought. Go in the other direction and then I film this way. So what I do is the first down and suck it. Doesn't hold. Oh god. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's on there. Not gonna move the camera. Put it in a nice position. Then I have the second suction cup and again two so safety if one fails still enough so this could hold again way more than this GoPro but it's good and here I can go a bit farther out because way too close you don't see too much when you go a bit out here it looks way better and I can adjust it in so many ways and it's still stable sticks a lot looks good like a hobo <laughs> even though this is not then for the final video this is just for you huh looking good for you okay time for some drone shots I have this beautiful case I love it usually with with drones uh, you have to well the mini 2 mini 3 but also other DJI drones you have to pack them unpack them and whatever and the old mini 2 I had to get my phones a, a phone attach it and everything and put the thumb screws on in here ah open it up drone is there already packed up already not packed up but like this even one battery is in there take it out put the cover on done
And then underneath, I put this up. There's the controller, the new controller with built-in screen. The, the, uh, the, the, the joysticks are already in. Let's just turn it on. Yeah, turn the drone on too. Yeah, we'll connect here. Takes a second. It has to boot up everything. It thinks we're in Africa. It has to find GPS now. That takes a second. But till then, I will do my settings. Put it in video. I can start recording. Turn it on. It's just a bit high. Do cine mode. Turn it around. Well, do it in normal mode, it's too slow. Drone shots are done. Sorry for the sound. It will sound horrible because I'm using the inside microphone of this uh, ZV E10. Now it's time to take some pictures. So I put my A7S3 here and the new monitor here. And then I can see how the picture looks like. I can see that a bit. And, and I want to have it as close as possible so I can see how will I look like, how will the framing be. Let's do that. Take a few pictures. Drone shots are done. So I did my pictures. Yes, yeah, screen was not uh, so usable with the pictures. Um, I wanted to, to, to control the A7S3 with the app, but the app doesn't connect to it. So I can see it on the, on the screen of the app and do the focus, everything. You don't have to touch the, the camera. Well, it didn't work. Now I want to do some focus shots. So I, that's why I have the ND filter on. With the ND filter on, I can down my, I can put down my aperture to the lowest setting, which is 1.8 for this lens. And then you have background blur and then I can go from the wide focus. So focus on, on the grass and then focus on the Volkswagen ID3 label or icon, whatever, logo. Now I put my gimbal on my tripod and I'm gonna do some moves so from left to right light to left something like this so it's not just boring yeah I think there was enough b-roll now it's time to film myself <laughs> it's the hat, it's not that warm today, but look at that area. 
I found a good area to film with a drone to park. Nobody's coming by. The next road is 200 meters that way. There's no house, it just ends here. There's this big grass hill that's good for the drone to fly over. I like it. Quiet. I like quiet. Hey ho, wonderful. I think that works. So now I parked over here and I filmed. Uh, so I did the ending, I filmed the ending still. I was up there, by the way. I filmed the ending up there still with the uh, uh, tripod. But now I filmed all the details inside the car. Number one is this. Uh, number one is this. And I'm done. Now I'm going home. It took three hours, a bit more, because of the whole filming before. Bye!